Too much snow forced Soldier Mountain to close today. They got overloaded with fresh powder and now there's danger of avalanches. Katia Stepovic caught up with the mountain's general manager. Katia, it sounds like maybe too much of a good thing. I know they didn't get enough snow earlier in the season and now they're just getting pounded. Mm -hmm. Too much of a good thing is exactly right. They say after getting 60 inches of snow at the top of some lifts, the risk of avalanches just got too high for them to open. Now, according to Paul Alden, the general manager at Soldier Mountain, because so much dry snow fell and then moist snow fell on top of that, conditions became too dangerous for them to open again. Today, crews are all over the mountain triggering small av avalanches to minimize the chances of real ones. It was all light, fluffy powder that has no base. And so what happens is that snow just tends to blow away. If you walk in it or put a pole in it, you're basically on the ground. People don't understand the danger this amount of snow brings. And, uh, and uh, we will not, we're not willing to take even the slightest of chances. If there's avalanche danger up there, we close, we have to close. There's two snowmobiles buried in there. Yeah, you can just see how much snow is on the ground right there. He says heavy snowfall also created walls that piled up around a lift entrance. And now that that has to be removed by hand rather than machinery, unfortunately, so they did have to close. Now they did also have a mechanical issue with one of the lifts that's being fixed today. So if avalanche mitigation efforts are successful on top of that, they plan to reopen tomorrow. So we'll just have to kind of wait and see Morgan. Yeah, we will. And they're not a big resort, Katia, so it's a lot yeah. of work for them too. Yeah. All right, thanks.